Okay, the driver. Um, it's the club that causes a lot of people a lot of troubles. Um, it's the most powerful club in your bag. So I think the problem that most players have trying to hit the driver straight is they think, I'm going to kill the ball. So instead of saying, hey, I need to hit it 250 or 230 or 280, um, they try to kill it. And when you try to kill it, your muscles tense, you're going to slice it or hook it or top it uh, or duff it. So what you want to do is say, hey, this club is the most powerful club. Swing easier so you, you can take advantage of the, of the length and the uh, loft of the club. So I've got the old driver and the new driver out here. But you can see the driver doesn't have much loft on it. It's pretty uh, flat. So this ball is going to be relatively low. So this is an old wood driver. Okay, and then here's an old metal driver. And then here's the new driver. So you can see the clubs have gotten a lot longer. Uh, so the new driver is real long compared to the old drivers. Um, and it's made of titanium and a bunch of other wonder materials. And then the shaft is carbon versus uh, metal. So you want to stand much further away from this ball because the club is so long. You want to line up with your target, draw the line back, get the club face uh, perpendicular, and get the uh, ball somewhat on your left instep. And you want to just be nice and relaxed. And that one's a little bit on the right side of the fairway, but it's not bad. So if you do all that, you'll have a good drive and you'll be in good position to use the rest of the clubs.